What's up beautiful people? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Nadine and I run a blog called NadineNaturallyOnline.com and we talk about everything from makeup, self-care to natural hair. If you're new here, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Alright, so today I'm going to be talking about a local hair care brand called Pure Royal. So if you want to find out more about Pure Royal products, then keep watching. Alright, so I received these products a few months back. Um, and I did a whole range of content for them on my Instagram page. So you can head over to Adnadine Naturally to check out my Instagram page if you want to see what type of content I created. But today I'm doing a review. This is not a paid review. This is just my opinion on the products. So they sent me four products. I got the shampoo and the conditioner. And then they also sent me the silicone serum. As well as the... Defining Cool Custard. So yeah, I'm going to start off with the shampoo and the conditioner. So the shampoo and the conditioner are both rosemary and chamomile infused. And it says on the product that it is for all hair types. It's a moisturizing and detangling formula which is sulfate free. And it just says that it promotes healthier hair, soothes dry scalp, stimulates hair growth and increases shine. So what I can say off the bat, for a product that says that it's sulfate free, the, the shampoo foamed up quite a bit. Like I was quite surprised at how much it foamed up when I was using it. So I don't know how sulfate free it is. I have had one of my followers message me and say that she was very upset with the product because it said that it had no harmful ingredients and then there were harmful ingredients in it when she looked because it had alcohol and stuff like that in but it seems to me like they have revamped the product completely and revamped the ingredients and but again if there are if there are ingredients that you are avoiding i would just double check before you purchase this brand so this is manufactured and made yeah well manufacturing it's the same thing but it's made in south africa it is a local brand and you know i love to support local the smell like on the scent it reminds me of that i don't know if you ever use palm up palm olive i don't know if i'm saying it right but they used to have like the, those the, they look like little triangle bottles the green one the apple one they smell like that it smells like apple i think like an apple shampoo, which was really nice. It was like a nice throwback scent when I used it. Um, when I used the shampoo, I did feel like it. my hair felt very stringy after using it. It felt a little bit um, stripped, I don't want to say. Yeah, stripped. Um, but like after using the conditioner, my hair did feel really soft and bouncy and nourished. So yeah, like... You obviously have to use them together, but if I was just using the shampoo, I don't think I would really enjoy the way it made my hair feel afterwards. Yeah, and this is suitable for dry and brittle hair. So that is the shampoo and the conditioner. I, I'm not sure what the prices are, but I will put them down at the bottom here so you can check it out. But it is supposed to be an affordable hair care product. You can see the packaging is super simple, which means that they are not going to be out like crazy prices. All right. Then moving on to the silicone serum. So this silicone serum has a UV filter and a vitamin E, which means that it's gonna help protect your hair from the sun. And it also contains shine enhancing silicones, which is gonna give your hair a really nice shine. Again, silicone might be on your list of no-no ingredients. So again, I wouldn't buy this product if you were avoiding silicone. The problem with silicone is that it creates a film on top of your hair that prevents moisture from getting in and it eventually will lead to product buildup if you're not washing your hair regularly enough. And on the back it says, Pure Royal Silicone Serum provides long lasting shine, mends split ends, stops frizzies and is alcohol free. Great for shining style and easy to apply to hair or hair extensions. It offers medium conditioning to give a sleek silky look without weighing hair down. All in all, it does what a silicone is supposed to do. I actually really enjoyed it. I don't use silicones very often. I, if I was straightening my hair after using heat, I would use the silicone on after that. Um, like just a little bit, just to give my hair a little bit of shine and lock in the moisture. Then my favorite product in this range is the Defining Cool Cream. 
super amazing. This is shea butter and coconut infused um, and it infuses moisture to define curls and provide lasting shine. Yes, that's what it says. <laughs> Not much to say about this. It did give me amazing definition. I was really, really impressed. The only thing about this curling custard is that it's very sticky. Like I felt like it was very, very sticky on my hands. And it's very thick, guys. It's literally, I don't know if you can see. It's literally super thick and like getting it onto your hair, it takes a few like strokes through to get your hair to accept it, to build it up. So you don't need a lot of it because it's so thick, it's gonna spread. But again, yeah, like you could put on too much and then get a little bit of a product build up situation, not a vibe. But yeah, it really like gave me great definition and it gave me soft bouncy curls, which I was really surprised to get because because it was so thick and sticky, I thought it was going to weigh my hair down, but it didn't. So, yeah. All right. So, that is my quick little opinion on Pure Royal hair care products. If you've tried Pure Royal, please hit me up in the DMs. Please leave a comment and let me know what you thought about their products. And if you are going to try them out, you can go to Clicks, And I think Diskim also sells their products. All right. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next week.